After four years of going to the gym every single day for hours and hours on end and blaming my genetics, I finally tried every workout under the sun on YouTube walking the weight off jump rope challenge to find out which workout would work best for me in my transformation. Hello daily student family, welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing well, I hope you're all doing good and if you're new here, hello my name's Kimberly and I hope you subscribe, turn your bell notifications on to get notified every single time that I upload and give this video a massive thumbs up. Now as you guys can tell by the title of today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys how I lost £27 in one month. Now you guys know I've had a four year struggle with weight loss. In the past where I'd try hundreds of workouts and I mean hundreds and I'd be doing all the workouts for hours and hours on end but nothing would quite work and I'm so excited today as we do on this channel to share with you guys which workouts got me from this to this. Do give this video a massive thumbs up if you do enjoy which workouts really helped me, which ones are the best and most transformative for my entire journey what I just saw the pounds drop like that. Do give this video a massive thumbs up if you want to see more of that. Don't forget to come over and follow my inspirational fitness page on Instagram as well as my podcast page as well. Now without further ado let's go into workout number one. Now you guys know I've tried thigh slimming challenges. My thighs, my stomach were my biggest part of my journey that I wanted to do this for. I mean I would have thigh rub 24-7 that would be so painful. I would never wear shorts. I mean I think I think it took me so long until I was at the stage where I was comfortable enough to even wear them and I think I never thought that was even possible. Genetically I just thought losing weight or losing thigh and belly weight was just genetically not possible because all the other women in my family had a similar build to me where you didn't have thigh gaps, didn't have any of those things. I just never saw shorts as a thing that was going to ever be possible. However, this first workout, I would say, changed my whole relationship with not only my thighs, but successful exercising for the first time in my life. It was this one. Now, this workout, I would say, gave me the most compliments. When I say that, I mean within a week, I saw drastic differences. I always say the importance of making sure that you're eating healthy and well. During this, you can see the optimum result. But let me tell you, after day one of doing this workout, I was walking as if my legs were like rocks. I was just, I did my stretches, but this workout burned me so much. I was sweating, I was out of breath. I just really felt it was working all the muscles in my legs possible. And I just felt so confident in the workout. I would do this workout about three to four times a week. You really want to get a good momentum. So I recommend starting off to three to four times a week. And I was just doing 10 to 15 minutes a day. You know, it's a really short video. So you have to imagine maybe at, during a break of a TV advert or TV program that you're watching, do a few, do a portion of the video, then do another portion of the next break. You can break it up and see really good results. Obviously for optimum, you want to keep going to keep your heart rate up, but it does work in that way as well. It's just such a powerful workout. This move in particular worked me like crazy. In my spare time, I would isolate this movement and do it continuously because you do want to be isolating movements to get the best possible push in those areas with those muscles. And this workout is fantastic. With my CrossFit background, I know this this workout alone has so many workouts that is heavily and highly re recommended in the CrossFit world anyway. And um, because we really want to be working the muscles, we really want to be working the muscle tissue because muscle tissue, more muscle tissue will burn fat. So this is why this one is so fantastic. You're going straight in with the legs. It will give you that burn. It will give you that push. And my legs dropped so crazily. I, I, I love it. I still do it till this day just because it is that good. Now the next workout that I went on to doing was in fact an ab workout. Now my main focus with the abs was finally getting abs for the first time in my life but removing a lot of belly fat. Now you can't spot reduce but when I tell you how amazing this workout is and it's very similar to the Lily Sabri one that she did before, this one in particular is just fantastic. Now I have seen a lot of the fitness gurus use this like Emmy Wong, Chloe Ting, Lily Sabri, but this one I think encompasses everything that I would say is one of the best ab workouts there are here on YouTube at all. When I tell you, you know when you laugh and you feel like your abs are just hurting because your muscles have been working that much. This is what this workout really, really gives me. It really encompasses movements like this. They're so transformative for a heavy, really intense burn. And it's just absolutely fantastic for that reason. I would say doing this workout three to four times a week was transformative for me, especially because I had a lot of issues with snacking and cravings and all that type of thing. And I think that when you really incorporate
incorporate a workout that can give you results even while you're trying to reduce your eating is absolutely fantastic I would say you know we results within two weeks was crazy for me and for the first time in my entire life I got abs just keep working these movements keep with a mindset that it will burn it will burn like crazy especially if you set yourself a 14 day challenge and do it in sort of a 14 day challenge routine it's absolutely transformative and because of the length of time that this video takes up I would even get to the stage eventually where you double it up so I would do this video and then do it again later on in the day just to really push and emphasize that build that muscle build and really working yourself and it really is just that 10 to 15 minutes a day that can transform your entire body your workout regime your mentality towards working out it's really really fantastic but I do always emphasize adding a little bit of a 20 minute walk every single day on top of doing these workouts is the cherry on the cake to seeing the speed which I saw in working out in losing the weight you have to remember that I didn't see any results for four years so this method was really the in encapsules what I would say was the epitome of my success in this run the next workout I'm going to show you guys is this one now guys when I tell you if you're not ready for a burn I would not urge you to challenge but if you're ready for results this is the one to do now this one I really particularly commend the movements in this one like I say again from a CrossFit background it's very easy to spot the workouts that are essential to getting that burn happening essential to getting some sort of pump burn getting your muscles working and also building up that muscle tissue and this workout is just incredible if you even YouTube people who have done this workout they have done before and after videos of how transformative and amazing it really really is so I would highly recommend this one it's one of my absolute holy grails this one I would put at the very top of the list I sleep this movement in particular it's gonna be fantastic if you want to push yourself to get that extra burn to get that extra sort of hit isolation as well because hit is fantastic and really important the incorporation of cardio muscle training and make sure you're doing your 20 minutes of walking a day it's just absolutely fantastic to really push those results in the period of time that I had I just went pedal to the metal and it it really is isolated in this workout. I mean, it absolutely smashes the nail on the head for that. The next workout that I went into doing is this one. Now guys, I, at this point, this was a little bit later on in my journey, I would say about week three. When I tell you that, so when you get a little bit tired, you want to continue to see results. Our bodies can get stagnant and this one will push you out of that stagnant stage. That's why I really, really love it so much. Now, the thing with this workout is you really want to make sure that you're doing it either broken up or with walking because when your body gets to that stage, you want to continue pushing. Isolate this movement. This movement is fantastic for people who, again, you have a busy schedule and um, you've just done your workout but you want to keep making sure you're working on it I would say around the house find things that are weighted and incorporate it with this movement there's nothing more amazing than adding weights later on about week three week two and a half in your journey to really emphasize a potential muscle growth muscle tissue growth and then nothing does that more than adding a bit of weight or weight resistance or any type of resistance you can get weights on Amazon for you know one pound or one one dollar uh, you can get resistance bands it's really important to ensure you're keeping your progress going and that was so crucial for me because I really saw how resistance makes that difference it's so easy to go okay I'm exhausted resistance no way but I will tell you that resistance just is you do less for more essentially if you want to do less of a workout or you're getting exhausted or tired resistance you can do less for more, less working out, more results. And that's what allowed me to continue to drop the pounds in that month because I was getting exhausted towards the end, but then I could do less for more results. So guys, I hope you have enjoyed this video. It's so important to remember that walking 20 minutes a day also, also hugely assisted in the entire process and the entire weight loss in this month. Just a journey that I really love to share with you guys to give you tips and ideas that you can also then incorporate for the entirety of your journey but also remembering that eating healthy is so important because that could be 70 to 80 percent of your results because you don't want to exercise but then also just put the weight back on as you're exercising you want to be able to have I like the visual motivation of the pounds dropping off and then continuing to go because that really helps push that motivation as well now guys I hope you have enjoyed this video and which workouts really helped for me if you would like to see more workout related videos of ideas that really 
really really helped me um with my weight loss journey do give this video a massive thumbs up don't forget to come over and follow my inspirational fitness page on instagram as well as my podcast page as well now i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys very very soon bye guys